You're watching Action News Now. Storm Tracker weather. Coverage you can count on. Blue skies out there in Redding. A little little bit breezy, but really definitely not feeling like winter. No, no, not at all. Uh, when will we see a shift toward winter weather? Will we see a shift towards winter weather? Let's check in once again with Jason. Yeah, hopefully not until next winter. That would be unfortunate. But yeah, we did have a cloud today. It was a beautiful afternoon for Northern California. No wind to speak of. That's going to be changing, though, tomorrow. We will have the wind picking back up again. The sun just a minute or two away from setting. Looking outside live on our Lexington Hill camera, you can still see the snow at the 5,700-foot level there in the foreground, but there are no clouds in that background. We would like to have more clouds moving into our sky. I'm going to show you if we have any coming. Right now in Paradise is 56 mild degrees, 62 degrees in Redding, 59 degrees in Chico. It's also 59 degrees in Weaverville and Oroville, 45 degrees in Bernie. But you can see the difference when we don't have that downsloping, warming wind. Everybody in the valley between 1 and 6 degrees cooler than just 24 hours ago. So no clouds outside right now, and that's the way it's going to be late tonight through most of tomorrow. We're going to have a mostly clear to completely clear sky on on Thursday, but the area low pressure just off the California coast that I've been tracking all week, it still wants to send some clouds our way on Friday. The bad side of that is they're not going to give us any good chance for any wet weather in the short term. Then we turn our eyes to the long term. We're going to have that ridge reestablishing itself on Saturday, so more sunshine for us above average temperatures. And here's those other two troughs of low pressure I've been tracking since late last week. The first one will still try to bring a little bit of light rain and a little bit of mountain snow to the northern half of our state, but it's not looking like it's going to be very successful. More than likely, we're going to have stronger breezes Monday. We'll have more wind on Tuesday, stronger than Monday. And then on Wednesday, still some residual breezes. We may, looking eight days out, have yet another area of low pressure. Those inside sliders bring stronger wind next Thursday too. So as far as the amounts of rain are concerned, they're not looking very encouraging. If you remember this from yesterday, I showed you this and everyone was receiving tenths of inches of rain, some places almost three-fourths of an inch, but unfortunately it's going the wrong way for us. Coming up in our second half hour, I'll show you if our other models have a little bit more optimistic view. As far as the wind is concerned, the breezes will start picking up tonight, and we'll have some breezes tomorrow afternoon, not quite as strong as they were yesterday, and certainly not advisory, watch, or warning worthy. Say that five times fast, but we will have the breezes keeping us a little bit milder tomorrow morning. We'll also have a little bit more of a warm-up tomorrow afternoon, and then weaker wind late Friday into Saturday. So here's your forecast for Thursday. We're going to have a lot of sunshine, chilly start to a mild day for Trinity and Siskiyou counties. Daytime highs in the 50s and lower 60s. For northeastern California, still cold tomorrow morning, dropping down to 13 in Alturas with a high of 52. For the ridge, we'll have the breezes beginning to blow late tonight and they're going to last through tomorrow afternoon. Lows a little bit milder, upper 30s and lower to mid 40s. Highs will still be nice for January, but I'd love to have some rain clouds instead. 50s and 60s. 60s tomorrow afternoon for the valley, a little bit milder, but only by a handful of degrees with that breeze blowing. 30s for lows, daytime highs in the mid to upper 60s. And for Glen and Butte counties, lows also in the mid to upper 30s, a little bit warmer than this morning. Highs also slightly warmer, mid to upper 60s tomorrow afternoon. Next seven days in Chico, we do expect increasing clouds Sunday and Monday. There's a slight chance for showers, but very little rain is going to fall, if any at all. And for the Redding area, we're going to stay in the 60s. Every day is going to be above average, but unfortunately, we have more wind in the forecast than rain and mountain snow.